Jake Paul. Jake Paul. Jake Paul. Jake Paul. Paul. He's known for being in the public eye, but today, YouTube star Jake Paul is making headlines. The 23-year-old has more than 20 million YouTube subscribers and draws a lot of attention with his online pranks and stunts. I have had fame since I was 17 years old. And eventually, you almost lose sense of who you were. And I realized that I was living my life for all the wrong reasons. Paul signed a deal with Showtime for his next fight. I mean, BC, are these two brothers the next big thing in boxing? This just into CBS Sports HQ. Jake Paul will take on former UFC welterweight champ Tyron Woodley in a boxing match taking place later this summer. The buzz is all Jake Paul. I think I'm looked at as the villain, but I don't care about people's perception of me. I think that's why people want to see me get knocked out. So many people come up to me on a day-to-day -day basis. You got to knock him the fuck out. To me, the Jake thing kicked off when you're corn Ben, yeah. and then you go into the locker room. I'm here for some clout. You and Ben are gonna have a lot in common after tonight. Both got knocked out in the first round. Four months in a row. And I got five world titles. You know about this. I got five world titles. You know about these young champs. And I just looked up at him. I was like, Yo, I'm about to knock your boy out in one round. <laughs> He's like, We'll see. We'll see. Yeah, look, I saw, I saw fear in his eyes. I saw a man who just accepted a fight mostly for a paycheck. I saw a man who doesn't really have a fight left in him and who will be finished and sent into retirement by YouTube Disney star boxer. Keyword, you saw a man. I will knock out the feet and embarrass Tyler for the August 29th. Let's, Let's go. go. Let's go, champ. Tyron, the chosen one, one. He can't even spar somebody with those I'm one of the greatest fighters ever. But what he hasn't done is even been to the third or fourth round. I've been in five round world title fights for three or four years straight. But August 29th, Cleveland, Ohio, you will see a boxing clinic. And this man doesn't go more than three rounds. I come alive in the fourth, fifth, sixth rounds in sparring, seventh round, eighth round. And when you knock some people down, you get that little surge that you're invincible until a motherfucker make you miss or eat that shot and walk you down like that's all you got. He ain't seen that. He was at the absolute highest spot. I believe he will go into the Hall of Fame, which is the greatest compliment you can get. If this narrative plays out and Jake Paul keeps on winning, this will be the greatest combat sports story in the history of ever. I will take him out in two rounds. And people are gonna come back and watch this interview and be like, God damn, this fucking asshole kid <laughs> this asshole. who dresses like a douchebag and wears jewelry and takes people's hats yeah. has predicted every single fight.